Okay, uh, this is Mod Man here, and, uh, from, uh, large wantings of, uh, this how-to, how to map your MIDI controller to virtual DJ, how to uh, set everything up. So basically what you want to do first is install your drivers, calibrate your DM2 controller, install MIDI yoke, which will be at, a link will be to, at the side of the video, install DM2 to MIDI, and uh, then open up DM2 to MIDI, which should be inside your start menu. Right there. Open DM2 to MIDI, whatever. It's going to ask you first drop down menu, MIDI output. And uh, let me see if I could actually open. See, like, it's going to look like this. For your output, just open it up. MIDI yoke 1. Input, MIDI yoke 1 as well. Hit OK. Whatever, OK. Leave this open. Minimize. Then go to Virtual DJ. Open that up. Um, go to Config, Remote Control. Uh, I already have it activated. You're gonna have to activate it. Config, and I already have things mapped here. So this is for my first uh, scratch wheel. Um, basically, what you do is I'm just gonna hit Change, but you hit actually. Yeah, let me just hit add what you want to do is you just basically want to map it so for the scratch wheel you uh, select scratch wheel then you move your scratch wheel and you can see where it says auto learn move it it's automatically going to map it and you don't want absolute you want relative so you want to change that to 127 okay then you hit okay and then for the crossfader, you hit add, move your crossfader just like the, th the, ch the scratch wheel. And then you search inside all for, it's all in ABC order, so it should be kind of easy to find it. Crossfader. And then this, everything's all set, so hit OK. So you got the crossfader. You can add anything else, like a play or something. I haven't really got into that, but to play the song automatically on which thing you want just uh... say you wanna play something so for browser mm, i don't know something like that well you find it here then you hit the play button on the top and then um... basically that's what you do you could make, map anything on here just like that that order so hit ok ok I'll open a quick song just to show you how it works. So I'm gonna open a song up. Um, pardon me, it takes a little bit to get to my music. So um, uh, my music, whatever. I'm gonna open up something here like uh, that, I guess. And uh, you can map anything to it. And I usually, since this was a fresh install, I usually map things like hot queue, which is easy. You just find the hot queue inside that little list. So I move the scratcher. You can see it's moving, and then I you can look at the crossfader. Okay, I could do it with my mouse, but you can see this is for real. Whatever. And uh, the two little A B buttons, they actually work. And uh, for scratching, just move back and forth, you're all good. It's really easy to do that, it's fairly simple. You really have to be a genius to do this, it's uh, really easy. So, this was a Modman production. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, you're welcome to anybody who really wanted to know how to do this. Peace out.